Well, turning back to weather now, people across the area headed out to Memorial Day gatherings today and tomorrow. Robert's here once again. And uh, Robert, what do we need to know? You'll need to know that you'll need sunglasses, light colored clothing, and sunscreen. Tonight, well, not tonight, but more <laughs> tomorrow, yeah. Uh, tomorrow's a sneaky sunburn day. So no matter what you're doing tomorrow, whether you are headed to one of our local cemeteries or hitting the pool for the first time, opening the pool or going to your local community pool, not a bad day for it tomorrow. Lots of sunshine. Temperatures in northwest Arkansas warming into the lower 80s by the afternoon with windy conditions at times, not just in northwest Arkansas, but the River Valley as well. You can see those temperatures rising mid to upper 80s and it will feel like it's in the 90s at times in the River Valley uh, tomorrow if you are taking a dip for the first time. Now big picture across the country, not too bad. We got a new severe thunderstorm watch up for portions of uh, Nebraska and spotty showers and storms across the northern part of the country, but the, the east, the south, the southwest, everybody dry at this hour, but it's warm in our area, northwest Arkansas, mid to upper 80s right now. St. Paul, one of the co cooler spots at 83. Slides into the River Valley, many locations. You get into southeast Oklahoma, right along the border there, right around 90 degrees, 91 in Paris, one of the warmer spots. Still seeing those gusty winds, 20 to 35 miles an hour at times. That's southerly winds ushering in all of that uh, warmer air. Now, over the next 24, 36 hours, really won't be too bad out there. You can see tonight, maybe a high cloud or two. Uh, all the action staying well, well back to our west. A couple of high clouds tomorrow morning, southern sections of the River Valley, but we should see a mostly sunny day tomorrow. So no problems, as I said, if you're going to any Memorial Day festivities or you have a family gathering planned, not too bad. It's once we get into Tuesday night and into Wednesday. You can see Tuesday morning, not bad, but here comes that front. As it gets closer to our area late Tuesday night into Wednesday, we could watch for a couple of uh, showers and thunderstorms, especially for northwest Arkansas. Storm Prediction Center does have extreme northwest Benton County in the marginal risk. Wouldn't be surprised if more of this gets filled in tomorrow or maybe on the day Tuesday. The real threat will be just to our north. You can see a large area of widespread severe weather possible across Missouri and into Kansas. But by Wednesday, that threat does shift it more into northwest Arkansas. So you're going to want to check back with us for updates. 60s and 70s tonight, a muggy night and a hot and windy and humid day tomorrow. 80s and 90s out there. And by tomorrow afternoon, it will feel even hotter. Widespread heat index values in the lower to upper 90s. Now, as we look at the extended forecast, you can see impact days Tuesday night for Northwest Arkansas and throughout the day on Wednesday. Temperatures cool down in a big way. Look at Thursday, just 71. No complaints here. Uh, with those cooler temperatures. River Valley about the same thing. No impact day Tuesday, but Wednesday's an impact day for now. We'll see if we tweak these as we get closer toward the event. Stay with us. We will check on the world of sports right after the break.